As we said before, in the Genesis trial version, by default the .NET language will be used to generate the application and the necessary programs to create and maintain the database. Microsoft SQL Server will be used as the database management system. In the full version of Genesis, one advantage is that it allows generating the same application for different platforms, generating code in different programming languages and or storing the application data in different databases. All this information is defined in an environment. An environment allows you to configure and store all the information related to a given implementation of your application. The generators that you want to use to generate the back end, the ones that you'll use to generate the front end, and the database information. If you have the full version, select the Preferences window by clicking on the tab next to the KB Explorer tab. You can see that there is only one environment defined by .NET environment. It was automatically created when we created the knowledge base and chose .NET as the generation language. Then it was populated with more information when you first press F5. The environment subnodes allow you to configure more properties. With the full version it's possible to create more than one environment for the same knowledge base. For example, you may create a development environment that connects to a database with this data and a production environment where you define the server and the database that will be used for the completed system. You may also want to create, in the same knowledge base, a new environment to generate everything for a different platform. For example, generate the code in Java and use another DBMS such as Oracle, MySQL, PostgreSQL, DB2 or others. For generating the front end, you can use Apple or Angular. To create a new environment, right click on the node of your environment, select New Environment, and then configure the necessary properties. To work with one environment or another, right click on the environment you want to activate and choose Set as Current. You can easily identify the active environment by the play symbol.